300 then we're hitting the road again so let's get back on the road we said so just 300 we said if you see kadudu driving on this road you know uh it's not from this area we're not from this area we just came to check on another car and uh, we're leaving so as i told you guys if you need to buy a car then you also can ask us we will get you the best car that you're looking for in the town and uh Kadari can take you any place that you want to go so Let's hit back on the Eastern Bypass, the most beautiful bypass ever in Africa. The only bypass that passes through a national park is when you have a bypass in whichever country that does that. It's only this one in Kenya, the Eastern Bypass. So let's hit on the road again. Make sure you subscribe. On that day when I was driving, uh, I almost missed it, but I, it was by faith I got it right. So you don't, the first one takes you back to the road, but on the opposite side, all right? Yeah. So the second one takes you back to the road now. Okay. So we are back on the Eastern Bypass again, as I said earlier, the only road and the only bypass that will pass you through uh, a national park. And the only thing you need to see the animals in the national park is to pay or to give, uh, not really pay, because you don't pay. You only pay to buy the fuel and uh, yeah, hire a guy if you're not a Kenyan, but if you're a Kenyan, you use your own, then you get to see. So we're back, this is on the other side of the, uh, so the other side of uh, uh, Eastern Bypass. So let's get rolling. The drive is smooth as possible. Uh, we're driving a uh, 650cc engine, so you don't mm -hmm. expect us to be that faster. 